Kyle from WeTech Care Review, and today I'm going to show you how you can get the current year in Power Apps. So, as you can see here at the time of recording, we're in 2023, um, and I'm going to use the year function. So, I'll put a link to this documentation in the description of the video. Basically, if I just do it here, it's very easy. I'll just insert a label. I'll just make this bigger. Basically, what we want to do is we want to do the year function. So I'm just going to type year, open bracket, and I'm going to do this a day function to get today's date. And now when I close my bracket, there you can see it's pulled back 2023 as the current year. Now, I hope this video helps. Please like and subscribe to the channel and take care. Thank you.